Leader, what a privilege, a joy working together. Some of you are friends of mine, personal friends, some others. I haven't seen them, but I will see you in heaven because there are so many people in this network. It's hard to bring them together to one place, right? But we are together already in the spirit of Christ. When we motivate our people to bring other people to pray, what happens? Number one, you're testing your faith. This is the month to bring people to the group. It's the last week of the month, I believe, by the time you get this video. And it will be a key to take advantage of that opportunity. If you have not bring, brought people to the group, mobilize your people so that everyone can bring one. So the first thing is that you are testing your faith. When you, after you pray, now you put your faith in action and you say, I'm going to start calling people and I'm going to mobilize my own people to call others so that we can, in fact, multiply prayer. Also, secondly, is that we grow in love. This is an, an exercise that will stretch our souls. And instead of being focused just on what we have, we will be focusing on people that have not had the joy of praying every day of their lives online. And one more, one more aspect of this is that we will establish an atmosphere of victory in our groups, not of defeat or plateau, but rather a, 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 we, we will establish an atmosphere of advance of tremendous victory. I believe the Lord is pleased with this. I believe he will say to us in the little things you have been faithful in big things I will put you in charge of. And so that's a promise. And we believe that instead of having mediocre ministries, mediocre prayer meetings, mediocre groups, none of that, we are all called to multiply prayer until we embrace the world in prayer. Keep strong. May the Lord bless every aspect of your life. And we work together until Jesus comes back.